What is going on, everybody? It is the Phantom Michael bringing you the next episode of our Pokemon Rejuvenation Let's Play. If you guys have not seen the last episode, be sure to check it out. Um, we I told you guys that I'd be grinding, but I kind of like fell short of that. So yeah, we did not grind. Um, do a quick team recap, and then we're gonna go hunt down a gym leader. Up first, we have a Falcon the Fletchender with the move Slam Charge Roost Quick Attack Peck. We have a Hong the Hypno with Hypnosis Wake Up Slap Psybeam Headbutt. We have Eric the Vile Plume Mega Drain Growth Cut Acid. We have Ringo the Kekleama Slash Shadow Claw Psybeam Ancient Power. We have Gator the For Alligator Scratch Ice Fang Water Gun and Crunch. Then we have the newest member of the team. Warwolf, the Lycan Rock with Rock Throw, Odor Sleuth, Rock Tomb, and Roar. So yeah, decent looking squad. Um, we're gonna head up north here to go find out about this gym leader that's in here. So let's find him. It always pains me to walk into this lobby. All the beautiful memories of lost lives, lost hopes and dreams. This place never fails to bring out my true feelings. After all, I was the one who started this ordinance of isolation. Tell me, why should we change our ways? Because it's wrong? Or know it's wrong, but our anger shall never die. Ah, oh, if only that were true. I'm tired. My tears have run dry and the anger that I once felt has subsided. I am a lady of the theater and of the opera. I yearn for the cheering crowd, the interaction of the foreign, the problem I face is with my own people. If I tell them to start opening up again, my head will be in the arms of the gallows noose. I don't expect you to to be of any help, so I wouldn't worry too much about it. You took care of those rowdy outsiders in the Pokemon Center, correct? If that's the case, then I must hold my end of the deal. I'll meet you inside of my gym. I, I mean, I didn't really hold up my end of the deal I guess okay so I'm feeling like ghost ghost type so I'm thinking my you know my Pokemon's that hit with the uh, Kecleon's gonna be really good look at you Kecleon's gonna be decent um totally just messed that up it's a uh, this way I believe yes okay back in Golden Leaf Town uh there we go. Ah, oh, Phantom. Good, Phantom, you're here. I was just about to give uh, Narcissa a piece of my mind. First of all, I don't appreciate this little attitude you and your people have against foreigners. As I, all, as I was just saying. No, just listen for a sec. What gives you the right to treat people this way? Is it because you have some, par some sort of superiority complex? Or is that, well, let me tell you something. It isn't appreciated by anyone. I'm aware of that. If you would just give me a moment to explain. Fine, go on and explain yourself. I don't agree with this town's attitude either. In fact, I yearn for change. Aren't you the leader of this place? Shouldn't that be an easy task? I am in fact their leader, but they've been so blindly blinded by hatred that they would never listen to me. One thing you must know about being a leader is that your decision is not always presented with an anonymous agreement. I am a leader, not a director. I guess you're right. Well, this still can't go on. We have to think of something. What about an assembly? And what of our safety? If they wanted, they could riot. I could fend them off, sure. But attacking my own people, I don't have the heart. Fans of mine could be there to protect you. We aren't weak. We could definitely hold the fort. That could work. Hmm. I think I may have a better idea, though. But as for now, I promised Phantom that I would battle them. We can discuss everything else later. Oh, what are you doing up there? Oh, shoot! Pardon me, but have we met before? Your face looks strikingly familiar. Shut up! Haunt her! Silence her! Ooh! Double team and shut her up as well. You're Phantom, right? That little shit that someone warped into our office? The name's Gira. I'm an Excellent executive. See, we didn't appreciate your little intrusion down at Haruto's Mountain. I'm now burnt to a cinder and in shambles, and you thought you'd just walk on our merry little way without any consequences. Yeah, that won't fly with us, homie. 
So as revenge, I'll choke these two to death. And they'll be on your hands. Are you pretty there? Shit. I promised Natasha I'd be unseen. You got lucky, but I'll be back for my revenge later. Haunter return. Oh, shit. This person is crazy. I'm sick of these outsiders thinking they can do whatever they, they please. Nick, lock them up. We'll have a meeting to figure out what to do with them later. Right. Let's go, let's go, you murdering maniac. Well then, that worked out in my favor. But am I satisfied? Nope. I'll take them to jail. You go to Wimpsy Tower and gather some rocks and debris. We're gonna have fun with this one. This chick is nuts. Wait a minute. She said Wimpsy Tower. Jesus Christ, I'm an idiot. How could I forget about Wimpsy Tower? Have I been gone that long? Is that thing still in Wimpsy Tower? If so, it looks like I'll be getting my revenge sooner than I anticipated. I heard that, you little shit. You aren't going to get anywhere with this. Okay. So I'm locked up. We're going to keep you here until we decide what to do with you. Have you decided to do something extremely radical like this because of us? If that's the case, then you're incredibly idiotic. So just sit tight. You'll have a lot of time to think about what you've done. Hey, watch them until we're back. Don't you dare let them escape. Hey, don't make any set of moves. Oh, what the? Give me the keys to the jail cell now. And why should I do that? Well, unless you want to be thrown halfway across. Okay. It says you give me those keys right now. Alright, just take them. Okay, sweet. Okay, so that was her Pangoro. Nice. Hey, the name's Mosley. Don't think I'm done with this because I love you. I just want to repay you for saving me earlier. I also thought you'd like to know something about that guy who got you in this mess. Yes, I was eavesdropping, but who wouldn't? Anyway, I heard him talk about Whimsy Tower. He said there was something there that would be important. I bet you, my mother's breakfast, that whatever he wants isn't good. So I don't know what you're going to do after this, but I think you should head on over there. I'm not going to force you, but if you expose that guy, maybe it might clear your name. Just a little thought. Okay, cool. Let's get the hell out of here. Huh, what a beautiful friggin' day, right? So I was thinking, maybe it's only right of me if I help you whoop some ass, right? So maybe I might. Hey, who let out the cell? Devour. Oh, shit. Is there a problem? Yeah, that's right. Keep walking. You don't have to worry about the people of this town bothering you. You go on ahead, though. I have to make sure Pangoro doesn't actually devour that girl. That looked bad on my resume, you feels. Sweet, okay. So let's get out of here. We're going to go down to Wimpsy Tower again, I guess, and find out what the heck's going on. So, Team Exxon's back on our trail, it seems. Thought we had, you know, kind of separated ourselves from them, but we have a haunch. Oh, shit. Team Exxon pulled up. I guess that's their van, dude. Shoot. That's what I'm talking about. Free kill for Eric. Free snack for my boy Eric. One one shot, one kill. Masquerade, rain, bug water type. Uh, bug water type. Ooh, Shadow Masquerade, dude. Ooh. 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 Mm. Oh, I don't have any Pokeballs, dude. Dang it. Pokeballs. Stupid, don't have no Pokeballs. Dang, let me go with some Pokeballs, I guess, just in case. I mean, thank goodness it was a Masquerade, because, you know, Masquerade ain't that great. But, uh, dang, it's sort of been nice to catch one.
Oh, look, a customer very in. Three great bowls. Let's get it. Not too. Fair trade. Go ahead, we'll keep trading. We will keep trading. Dang, dude. Sucker punch me, that's fine. That's fine. Just crunch it a bit. Look at that. That's fine for your swipe turn, that's fine. But you're also going to get eaten. Make sure there's no more Team Xen around anywhere else. Okay, nope, he said beat it. Man, Team Xen is causing a ruckus. Are there any more of them? Nope, looks like, looks like we got we got all of them. Hmm. I don't want to be bestowed anything. Let's get it. Whoa, what the heck was that? Nothing. Oh yeah, he didn't kill him below it. Okay. Hella confused for a second. Ooh. How long has it been since I've last visited this place? It's torn to shreds now. Huh? Did they let you... Did they let the baby out of its pen? Hmm, my pointless remarks don't even put a dent into you, huh? You always get that dumb expression on your face, you creepy little psychopath. But if you want to stick your nose where it doesn't belong, that's fine. Then let's make this a little enjoyable. I'll be waiting at the bottom level of this laboratory. I still have some things to iron out, so I can't have you meddling. Charlene, can you hear me? I can hear you. Just fine, so stop shouting. Also, it's Sharon. Details, details, just close the gates. I'll be down there in just a moment. That was a big fat loser that guy is. Man, that guy can go on and on about stuff no one cares about. Like, please save me all this anxious and teenage hostility, please. I hope I'm not like him when I'm a teenager. Anyway, let's look around and see what we can find around here. I'm sure there's some way to open these gates around here somewhere. Okay. Okay. Done, Spurks! Team X and Ho right there. I'm about to get whooped, girl. Oh, we sing. That's fine. That's fine. Be drill. No shout one kill. Let's go and go right in the Falcon. Do a quick attack and kill it. No hit. Yeah. 
Tropius. Okay, I had a Tropius called Trouble. Is that a shadow? It looks like a shadow Pokemon. I want it so bad. Dude, I might put that beast on the team, bro. Gosh, I'm gonna put that on the team. Oh, it's burned. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Get burned. I'm gonna throw a Pokeball. I can't catch it because my thing's broken. Oh man. Dang it. Dang it. I kinda wasted those Pokeballs now. Dang. A dag on Pokemon. Oh, a gibble would be tight. A gibble would be tight. It's fine. It is fine. I'm dead. Goodbye, gibble. Another gibble? I'm just gonna keep on ice fanging. Just gonna keep on ice fanging until you're done. Dratini. Oh, this is a pure dragon type trainer, huh? Your dragons. I'd have banked on a shadow routine. Dang, better not mess with you when you freaking max out your team. You would be a force to be reckoned with. Some Arbok action going. Uh, let's go into Warwolf, see if Warwolf can take anything. Stop piling. Okay, you got a pile of one, defense rose, okay, special defense rose, sounds good, rock throw, stop pile, go ahead, that's fine, that's fine, keep on going. you up and out. That attack, those stealth rocks, yeah baby, you're learning stealth rocks. You're definitely learning stealth rocks. There we go. Is that strike that we're switching on? We're going with... Let's go with the Warwolf, huh? Let's go with the Warwolf. And go with... Let's rock too. Drop some speed a little bit. Yeah. Do another one. Keep dropping that speed. That's all I need. That hit a lot. Rock throw. Finish that off right there. Done. Done. Shell voice coming out. Is that a shell voice? A little shell voice. Finish that with a Mega Drain. Wow, survive, dude. That's crazy. Rain dancing up. Okay, bro. I see you, big dog. 
rain dancing up. Gotcha. Okay, let's see if I can heal real quick. I don't know if talking to her heals or just after every battle heals. But, uh, I don't know. So, we're just gonna play safe. Dang, there's so many chooses, so many choices. Oh, I have been. Okay. What the hell is that? Yeah, I'm gonna activate the panel, dude. Sun sparse. I don't wanna fight it though. I'm scared. Sun sparse might kill one of my Pokemon. Let's see what you got, dog. A drowsy. Leon. That's fine. Shadow Claw. Boom, that's what I'm talking about. Good night, Irene. Magnemite switching back into Falcon. Flame charge up. Burn. Ooh, you paralyzed me though. Am I still faster? Nope. Aw, oh, damn it, you got me. Come on. Yeah. Good job, Falcon. Good job, Falcon. Can I do it again? That's what I'm talking about. Oh, so close to Othoan. So close to Othoan. That's fine. That's fine. I did get cocky. That's fine. Going to Warwolf. Rock throw. Got the Magnemite. Level 30. Drowsy coming out. Rock throw. Yeah, that's fine. Meditate. That's fine. That's fine. You know, Rock throw. Got him. Drowsy's toast. Up and out. Drowsy. Oh, oh. Super potion found. I like the color of that. Oh, can't go in there. What the hell is that? It looks like an old and battered journal. Entry one. Greetings. I work at the Whipsy Radio Tower. Together we created an experience that was unmatched by no one. Soon what was supposed to be an innocent job turned into something much more intense. We all thought that we had influenced the change in the world. What could one do to change the mind of others? This is what we were interested in. How powerful is our influence? The head of the radio, Sirius, believed that one with a voice can change the mind of anyone who listened. But there's a game to it. Certain key words that must be carefully crafted together. I was intrigued, so I joined his efforts in creating a new world with our influence. How deep this will go, only time will tell. Okay, oh, there's a panel hidden right there. You little snake. Little snake hidden in the panel. Did that make something? Did that do anything? Did that turn on? I don't know. I don't know. Itchy. Alright. Stupid grass. Okay. Oh. Okay. No hidden items. No hidden items. Shoot! Okay, I have to be very careful. No panels here. Okay. No panels there. Battling her. Gonna wreck her. Kodabora. Kodabora. Let's go Gator. That's fine, you wanna reflect, that's fine. How you, how you gonna stop that though? You toast. You're toasty, you're melted in the ground. Or shut it. I'm not even switching, bro. One by one, I'm just gonna keep on. One by one, I'll just keep on. One by one, I'll just keep off. You're gonna Psy shock me, are you? Boom, you're toasty. 35. Okay. More panel, there's another panel. 
Ooh, got him. Did you hear that? It sounded like doors opening or something. Do you think the doors upstairs finally open up for us? I'm gonna go upstairs and check. Don't leave. Looks like journal number three. I walked into our lab today and Cyrus said he had something to show me. My interest was picked. I decided I had wanted to follow him. What I saw was absolutely unbelievable. I saw the legendary Pokemon Garatinas. Sirius said that our influence wasn't enough, so we could not change everyone with our radio tower. He said that we could only create a new world by destroying this one. He sounded like an absolute madman, but he talked as if it was completely sane. I was a, I was a hypnotic experience, if I'm honest. That's why I opted to continue helping him regardless of the result would be. Together, we're going to destroy and recreate the world in our image. Hmm. That's scary. Martha! Coming back for revenge. But not today. Not today, Bertha. Another Bertha. Not today, Bertha. Not today, Bertha. Not today, little Bertha. Not today. Huh. Oh, you're Narkisa. And you're that child that likes to steal from residents from my town. Mostly, was it? Uh, well, yeah, I mean, it's nothing personal, but how have you been? I know you were attacked recently, you know. Indeed, I was, with that other girl. Alita, was it? She's still resting at my house, but enough about that. What in the world is this place? What is it doing underneath Wimpsy Tower? Um, I actually don't know. It seems to be some Team X in base, I think. All I know is that this place is super old. We have things growing around everywhere. The fact that this place is old concerns me greatly. I'd love to ask about what you two have found down here, but I believe that we'll get our answer by just continuing on. Down those stairs, down those stairs. Oh man, my man is going to kill me if she finds out what I've been doing. Too late to turn back now. Let's do it. Let's get it. I'm scared. Hmm. Oh, look who it is. It's Phantom. Yes, I could see that, Sherlin. Disregarding the battling wrong, the blatantly wrong name, we were ordered to stall for t for time a bit. It looks like Gira is having some issues. They close the door on, on us the moment we walk past it. What kind of jerk tries to trick a child? The kind of jerk who was ordered to. I don't know, kid. Anyway, we should get this over with, right? So yeah, let us start. Oh, it's the dimwits and the... Okay. Aunt Crow and Miss Maggie. Oh, they up their team, boys. They up their team. Okay. Let's freaking flame charge Miss Maggie's. And I'm going to go ahead and off the bat, just right off the rip, hypnosis. Mystic fire, bro. That move looks dope. Boost that. Yeah, hit it off the rip. Alright. Keep on hitting the Miss Magnus. Side the Miss Magnus. We're gonna kill the Miss Magnus right now, is what we're about to do. Shadow Ball. Okay. Ooh. Damn it. Okay, Honchko came back. It's fine. That's fine. Kekleon coming in. Flame charge the Smaggies fight, and I think ancient. Oh, it doesn't. Aw, oh, you lucky son of a gun. That's fine. That's fine. Thunder wave. Ooh. Honchko knows thunder wave. That's crazy. That's what I'm talking about. Good job, Ringo. Tangle is coming in. Flame charge the Tangle, you. Shadow claw. Power gym. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. All right, got Miss Magnus down. Let's go, Gator. Ice Fang. That fight, and we're going to Ancient Power Lift time. Thought I could kill him one hit. Thought it'd be a one hit knockout type situation. 
thought it was going to be a one hit knockout type situation. I was wrong. Acid fight ancient power. Got him. Got him. You ain't going to like this ancient power. Got him. Oh, we beat him. Oh, darn. We lost. Whatever shall we do? Um, well, I guess we have no other choice but to bail, right? I mean, clearly we have nothing else to do. We're definitely not no use here. But first, we should open the door, right, Eli? Yes, Sarah. <laughs> it's Sharon. How hard can it be to remember such a simple name? Sharon. All right. Well, I'm over it now. Let's just open up this stupid door and beat it. Okay. My word, those two are inter interesting individuals. Interesting or not, they're jerks for locking us in here. They were only following orders, as they said. There must be something admirable about that, even if they're only a little. Oh, whatever. They said Giran was having issues, though, right? If they stopped us here, that must mean that he's nearby. That would be a wise assumption. Be ready, you two. We don't know what's down here. Prepare yourselves before following. We'll be fine. Let's get down. Narcy. All right, you guys. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please smash the like button. Of course, always greatly appreciated. But with that, we got to end it here. So I'm the Phantom Michael. I'm going to get the heck out of here, and I will see you in the next one.